Hi everyone, you must be wondering what this uh, tool is. This is basically a Volkswagen tool uh, meant for uh, cutting holes on the bumper for installing parking sensors. Now, most cars already come with rear parking sensors and as some of you would know, my Polo was uh, among the first cars in the country to have uh, front parking sensors as well. I It was a complete uh, DIY. I did it step by step, researched all the parts and uh, was successfully executed. Took some time to source some parts. Some of them came from uh, the Europe, the connectors, etc. I did the wiring harness by myself, sourced all the parking sensors from the local service center, including all the attachments, and uh, I installed it uh, by myself. Now, here's the thing. This is uh, part of the bumper, front bumper, sourced by my good friend Siddharth, and he had sent it to me. I'm going to show you how to install this hole on the front bumper. Now, in the facelift, uh, the first facelift of the Polo, which India got sometime in 2014, those bumpers actually came with uh, the holes uh, marked. Let me just show it to you. Okay, so you see this uh, hole which is already cut here. If you pay attention, you can see a small boundary right here. This hole is pre-marked in the front bumper. So it's easy for you to install it should you desire to install front parking sensors. I'll make a separate video of how to go about with the installation. I can't uh, do it with videos, obviously because I don't have the car with me anymore. But I'll do justice to it uh, by having as many pictures uh, as possible for explanation. So it's easy for you to install. In this video, we'll see how to cut these holes. See these beautifully cut uh, holes. They don't leave absolutely any jagged edges. That's the beauty of this uh, tool. So ideally, you know, uh, if you have this tool, you can share it with your friends uh, and uh, get this uh, installed. Installation is very simple. All you've got to do is drill a hole first, equivalent to inserting this uh, screw, and then have it uh, inserted from the rear while this particular unit comes on the front side. And as you tighten the screw, it'll cut a beautiful hole here. I'm going to show you how. So first you need to drill a hole here. So I have this uh, drill bit here. This is about uh, seven mm. You're going to need a 6mm allen key for turning the allen screw on the Volkswagen tool. Once you've tightened it from the rear side, from this side, thread it by hand and tighten it. Essentially, you are manually cutting the holes, so it will need a little bit of elbow grease. Once you're done, just unscrew it and then let me show you the results. Check this out guys, how beautifully has this hole been cut. Now, if you use an alternative, uh, that is the conical drill bit, you will get jagged edges here and it will not sit flush and you will have to sand it down. In this case, you do not have to, you know, repaint your bumper. Believe me, if you have this tool and if you have a Volkswagen, it is a perfect tool for installing those sensors. So in case you are uh, looking forward to install uh, front parking sensors, this is how you do it. Wait for my other video on the front parking sensor installation. Thank you so much guys. Hope you like this video.